Good morning, Mountain View. I'm Joe. And I'm Aaron here with the news and morning announcements for Friday, March 31st. Today in sports, varsity baseball hosts Wilcox and cross out baseball travels to Wilcox. Swimming will host Wilcox and Santa Clara. Boys volleyball travels to Harker. Go Spartans! In other sports, it's Final Four weekend. Let's watch. Welcome to the Final Four edition of March Madness Live with Joe and Aaron. Yeah, so we had a great Elite Eight and teams that are going to be coming out playing the Final Four include Gonzaga, South Carolina, Oregon, and North Carolina. And on the women's side, Stanford will be playing South Carolina in the Final Four and Mississippi State will be playing UConn in the Final Four. Our predictions for the national championship game on the men's side, or I'm, I'm going with North Carolina to defeat Oregon and South Carolina to defeat Gonzaga. Um, I agree on the North Carolina portion. However, I think that Zaga will beat South Carolina. This magical run has been has gone far enough. I think they'll finally get defeated by uh, Will or by Nigel Williams Goss and the Gonzaga Bulldogs. I think Cinderius Domo can single-handedly take South Carolina to the national championship game, we'll and no one can stop him. On the women's side. It's pretty hard to stop UConn. I mean, they have an over 100 game winning streak, and I don't see anyone beating them. But hopefully Stanford can beat South Carolina and make it to the national championship for the sake of our Bay Area teams. That's our final four update. Today for lunch, the cafeteria is serving chili nachos. Con congratulations to Eunice Yang, finalist in the U.S. Chemistry Olympiad competition. Eunice will be competing at the national level on April 22nd as of the 15 students representing the Santa Clara Valley section of the American Chemical Society. Great job! And in other congratulations, for the third year in a row, MBHS qualified for State Science Olympiad Championship. On March 18th, Mountain View High School uh, fielded both its black competitive team and gold team in training teams at the Santa Clara Science Olympiad Regional Tournament. For the third year in a row, the MVHS black team qualified for the state championship by taking second place overall. Only the top four schools per region advanced to the state team championship. To earn this title, the MVHS black team won 19 event medals out of the 23 event tournament. The gold team had their best season yet by placing 8th overall with 9 event medals. Congratulations to both the MBHS black and gold teams, now on the state championship. Make sure to join the Ambassadors Club, which promotes inclusivity on campus, runs freshman orientations, holds transfer retreats, shares an ELD partnership, and conducts middle school terms. Applications will be due in the office Friday, April 7th. You will be interviewed after you turn in your application. Did you order a 2016-2017 yearbook? Well, if you don't know, there's a list at the finance office window. Prices will increase soon, so make sure to order now. There are PTSA scholarships for those who cannot afford one, and information is at the activities office. Seniors, Jocelyn will be in the back parking lot today at lunch. Make sure to get your grad stuff you ordered. Wind Ensemble and Chamber Orchestra auditions will take place all next week. Olympico Learning and Leadership Academy is looking for highly motivated and committed high school students who wish to volunteer and explore careers in teaching and STEAM this summer and give back to their communities in the K through fifth classrooms. Students with experience as an avid or peer tutor are especially encouraged to apply. All inquiries should be directed to Nancy Rafati at olympicolearning.org or see Mr. St. Clair for further information. If you need to make up a class or take help online, our forms will be in the counseling office and make sure to get them and do summer school. That's the news for today. Thanks for tuning in, Mountain View. Have an excellent day and weekend.